after an eight-hour standoff, the doors of the UK immigration enforcement van were opened. People power on the streets of Glasgow had forced this U-turn, and two Indian men who had faced detainment, possible deportation, have tonight instead been released. The men have now spoken exclusively to ITV News. When the door opened, how did you feel? That's happy. It's feeling quick. All the sport, all the people is coming here to the sport is the happiness. Do you have anything that you want to say to the people who came to support you today? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Speaking in his native Punjabi, Lakvir then told us what happened. I was taken unannounced from my flat. They barged in and took me into the van. I was anxious and upset, wondering how I would be treated at the detention centre. But this community was determined to stop that happening. Hundreds immediately poured onto the streets surrounding the immigration van, even lying under it. This is Nicola Sturgeon's constituency, and the Scottish First Minister had pleaded directly with the UK Home Office to stand down. This was a cynical and pr provocative action by the Home Office to do it on the day of Eid. Let's be honest, they don't give a damn about the lives of these people. Um, the people of Glasgow do. This city is built on the backs of refugees, people who've given blood, sweat and tears to build this city. So we do have those proud traditions and we stand firmly with these men. Mm. A UK Home Office statement said this operation was conducted in relation to suspected immigration offences. I'm happy to support my own I'm happy. But ultimately it was the people here who decided their neighbours were not leaving today. I'm so happy that my fate brought me to live here in Glasgow where the people are so connected that they'll come out onto the streets to help one of their own. These two Indian nationals have been here 10 years and are still living in Scotland without leave to remain. But for tonight they are back home with family, within a community that has fought off the Home Office to keep them here. Peter Smith, News at 10, Glasgow.